How to combine multiple worksheets into one worksheet in Microsoft Excel. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel Game Tutorial. In this advanced Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can combine multiple worksheets into a master worksheet. Okay, I have four worksheets here in this workbook, sheet one, two, three, and four. I have data in all four of them and they are in the same formatting. ID, job title, email address, and first name and last name okay now i want to combine all four worksheet into the first worksheet which is sheet one okay so we have data from cell a1 to a101 okay and i want the second should be placed from here and after that the third worksheet and then the fourth worksheet okay i have created several tutorials on combining workbook and worksheet you can check them here and in this tutorial i'm going to use the vba so let's get started the trick is simple when you are using vba if you have the vba code prepared you can use it any way you want so i have already prepared the code and i'm going to apply it here okay first click on the developer tab if you don't have the developer tab on your ribbon please check out this tutorial and you will learn how you can add developer tab to your ribbon in excel okay once you are in developer tab click on visual basic then insert and then module now you will have to write the code i have already written the code once you have written the code either run the code from here or you can close the vv i haven't run the code yet click on macro and then click on run you can see in the sheet one we have data from cell a1 to a401 okay you can see we have 400 rows in sheet one which already combined all four worksheet you can see they are already marked okay so we have copied this selection from sheet two and placed it here and this selection from sheet three placed it in the first worksheet this selection in the last worksheet which is sheet 4 and also placed it under the data of our first worksheet so this is how you can combine now here it doesn't matter what is the name of your worksheet it will work just like it and if you look at the data here we have id job title email address and first name and last name this is the header i have header in all four worksheet okay but the data I copied is excluding the header. That's why it has blended here perfectly. Okay. So when we copy the data, we don't copy the header with it. So if you don't have header, then try to add a header because the code is specified to copy the range from row 2. If you don't have header and you have data directly in row 1, that will be missing. Okay. Another important part is that if you think you want to create a new worksheet and then you want to combine them, you will have to create another worksheet and it doesn't matter what is the sheet name, but it only matters you place that worksheet at the beginning. Okay, so let's try it here. Sheet 1, let's name it master and now look closely. We cannot give a blank worksheet. It will not work. Okay, we'll have to create the column header here okay so this is our column header let's auto fit it now we need to add another row of data okay so I copy it and paste it here okay now if I run the code it should work so we need a header and at least one row of data okay so if I click here macro and click on run you can see it's working we have combined all the worksheet into the master worksheet okay but if we don't give the first row of data here it will not work so two things you need to remember one if you are creating a new worksheet you will need a header and at least one row of data okay and the second important thing is that you must place the master worksheet or the worksheet where you want to combine at the beginning of your workbook okay you have to place it here at the first position okay 
it doesn't matter what is your worksheet name but this position matters a lot okay if the sheet one is at the beginning the data will be combined to sheet one if this master worksheet is at the beginning the data will be combined to master worksheet so this is how it works and this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial if you can support the channel through patreon and if you need the code please check the link in the description thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial